Here at home, Congress narrowly avoided a government shutdown, passing a $1.2 trillion spending bill. But lawmakers still have major decisions to make on things like funding for Ukraine and Israel. And Republicans are once again flirting with the idea of booting out the Speaker of the House. NBC's Capitol Hill correspondent Ryan Nobles joins us. Ryan, good morning. How do you expect this to play out? Well, Savannah, good morning. You know, Congress did leave Washington on Friday for a two-week recess despite quite a bit of unfinished business, including that $95 billion aid bill for Ukraine and Israel. And House Speaker Mike Johnson has said that they will address it after they got the spending bill cleared, but he does face a series of headaches and growing discontent among conservative House Republicans after relying on Democrats to pass that spending bill, which is something that led to the ouster of the previous Speaker, Kevin McCarthy. Now, Georgia Congresswoman Marjorie Taylor Greene, she actually filed a motion to vacate or oust Johnson, but there's no vote on it yet. It could, though, get more support if Johnson brings that Ukraine aid bill to the floor because of the level of skepticism among House Republicans. Several conservative House members, they're already warning that the motion could garner more support if Johnson does move on, on, on Ukraine. So the bottom line right now, Johnson's troubles boil down to Republicans' razor-thin majority, which is only getting smaller because two GOP congressmen just announced plans to step down early. It forces Johnson to turn to Democrats to mostly pass anything, and he may have to rely on them again to save his job if that motion to vacate gets enough support. Savannah? All right, Ryan, thank you very much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.